When I was growing up, my parents were always extremely supportive in providing me opportunities to kind of explore anything I was interested in. Both of my parents are problem solvers. They introduced me to this program called Odyssey of the Mind. It really promotes problem solving and teamwork. So you're with a group of six of your peers and you have this problem that you need to solve. And that problem can be technical related, it can be more artistic. And throughout the year you get together with your peers and you work on this problem. And at the end you present your solution and there's a series of competitions. I really was attracted to both art and engineering. I really like to create things and make things with my hands. Eventually I decided on engineering and I've been really happy ever since. Especially when I discovered product design because it actually combines art and engineering. So now I'm like, yay, I get to do both. <laughs> Hi, I'm Karina Donzi and I'm the senior mechanical engineer at Aquama. In my everyday work, there is some sketching. For example, if Ruben and I are collaborating, we'll do a lot of just drawing on paper. And then in CAD, I use SolidWorks and that you know, is modeling up different components, trying to move them around in space, seeing how things fit together. And then once we have initial designs for things, if we can, we'll 3D print them in-house. If you have an actual prototype and you need to modify it in some way, then, you know, the files and the X-Acto knives and the Dremel and the drill all come out. Then plastic starts flying. <laughs> It is really fun to yeah, get hands on, get away from your desk, make something. It's very satisfying to hold something that you've made. I started rock climbing in college with my boyfriend, now husband, and we started 10 years ago. It really appeals to the problem solving engineering side of me. Every rock climb is sort of like a miniature problem that you're trying to solve. Like, how do you get to the top? What is the best way, the most efficient way, the most elegant way? Maybe that's the only way you can get to the top of something. So, you know, the only way you could see that view is, is if you had climbed to the very top, and that's also incredibly satisfying. The Denver deployment last summer was a very fast-paced project, and it incorporated a lot of new challenges. We have this gigantic failure log, you know, maybe it's a solution log because it's just full of all the little things that we came across and how we solved them and, and what it is we need to do next time. Someday we might move beyond air quality into other aspects of environmental health. I'm really excited to be working here and creating things that can help make the world a better place.